Hello everyone, my name is Ashish and in this video we are going to discuss on the topic all versus remove filters. As you can see on my screen, uh, here is the definition uh, for all and remove filters. So for all it says returns all the rows in a table or all the values in a column ignoring any filters that have been applied. Whereas remove filter says clears filters from the specified tables or columns. So if you notice carefully you can see the first difference here itself in the definition. In all, it says returns all the rows. So it's returning the rows from a table. Whereas in remove filters, it is not returning any rows. It is just clearing filters from the specified table or columns. So this is the first difference between all and remove filters. Uh, I will show this difference practically later in this video. Now here we have a product name slicer and uh, here we have three cards and then we have a table visual so in the three cards visual we have three definitions for one for total sales and then the second one is total sales calculated with all function third one is total sales calculated with remove filter functions let us quickly see the definitions of these measures so first one is total sales it is simple sum of the amount and the second one is total sales with all function calculate sum of the amount here i have used all functions inside the calculate functions so if you see the syntax of the all function it says table name or column name and then column names so here i have given a table name sales if you want you can give any column names and if you want you can give multiple column names as well and the syntax will be first give the table name and then comma and then you can give multiple column names so this was uh, the measure for total sales with all function. Now let us see the total sales with remove filters function. Here we have used calculate sum of amount and then remove filters and then it's having the table name. Let us see the syntax. So it says table name or column name and then column names. So the syntax for both all and remove filters are similar. There is no difference. So what happens if I choose any product? Let us choose a product. Let's say iPhone X. So if you see this total sales is changed, it is showing sales for the iPhone X. But these two measures with all function and with remove filter function, it's showing the total sales for all the products. So all and remove filters functions, both the functions works in the same way inside a calculate function. Now let us see uh, what is the difference between them. For that, let's take a table visual. and uh, i have written a measure to show the difference so this is the measure let me show you the measure so it says uh, so in this um, in this measure we have calculated two table variables first one is all products uh, with all function and the product name so it should return all the product names ignoring any filters and the second table would be all products remove filters that is uh, we have used remove filter function here with, with product name so it should uh, uh, also return me so it should also return all the product names ignoring any filters now i have written the logic calculate sum amount and uh, the all products so all product is a table which is returned by the all function so from this we are getting this value 4 to 500 which is correct now what will happen if i use remove filters instead of all products let us use and uh, see what happens. If you see, it's throwing me an error. Let us see the details of the error. If we see the error, it says remove filters function cannot be used as a table expression. It can appear only as a filter in calculate. So this is the difference what I was talking about. So remove filters cannot be used as a table expression. It, it cannot return rows. Whereas all can be used as a table expression and uh, it can return rows. So that was all about the topic all versus remove filters. If you like the video, do not forget to subscribe my channel to not miss any updates in the future. And thanks for watching.